10 years or so ago, I'm talking with a commercial real estate agent and he asks me about the, the Home Showcase, which was a, a weekly publication of printed listings that came out with the, the newspaper. And he asked me if I advertise properties there. And I said, yeah, for sure I do. And he said, well, is it effective? And my answer was no, it's, it's not effective at all. Like we rarely ever get a call from the newspaper anymore. So why do you do it was his next question. And my answer to that was, well, our clients expect us to. To which he responds, well, isn't it time that we stop lying to our clients? And man, that really struck me hard, like at the core, right? Because I considered myself a, a pretty honest guy, but I realized that, yeah, that is a lie. Like here I am, uh, a real estate agent, and I'm actually doing something that I know is totally ineffective because the person I'm working for might think that it's necessary. You know, whenever, I mean, we're living in a society that's uh, really used to white lies. Uh, they're harmless, we, we feel. But you know, as a, as a real estate agent or any other type of professional, when you step over the line and you um, tell your client something that isn't true, you've actually like, made a little terror in the fabric of reality. You've moved them into a world of fantasy and they're actually making decisions based on false information. And God only knows where that's going to end up. It could end up anywhere, but it's probably not going to be good. And even in a case like this where uh, you, you might think, well, that's pretty harmless. But the truth is, if I'm focusing resources on things that are ineffective, that takes those resources away from things that can really be effective. So since that day, I have never run another newspaper ad. And since that day, I've spent well over $100,000 on online advertisements. And the exposure that we've been able to bring to our listings has gone through the roof because of that. So you have to examine these moments of untruth from every possible angle. And when you do, I think you'll realize that you're hurting the person that you're telling the lie to. And you're probably hurting yourself too, because at your core, you know that you've done something wrong and that's going to come back to bite you in the ass.